next letter is uh, from prisoner 0231 and um, listen this is a very hard one for us to think about but we're gonna do our very best to give you some really golden amazing advice okay so sis I need you to put your tidying very close to the letter as I read dear Bonnie and Bonnie I really want to go out and party with my friends but I can't make it out of the house with my parents knowing mm-hmm do you have any tips on how to do this without them knowing sis I've never been through it personally I've never been through it but sis maybe you would have some kind of advice no, just like you, sis, because we were together. Oh, look, it's really hard because we've never actually been in that situation before. Oh, you know, because our parents, they were amazing, weren't they? They used to just abandon us and we used to just have to feed ourselves and everything by ourselves for years, many, many years. But for you, I guess, I don't know. Uh, you feel like a prisoner, but you're living at home with your mom and dad. I think the best advice would be get a job. Okay, get a job and buy your own apartment. That way you can sneak in and out. So it's like, guy me out, you know. Maybe just think of something. How would you creep out of the house without them knowing? Well, I personally would, uh, you know what you should do? If you've got parties like us, is if you've got a salu, just put a nightgown around the salu and put it underneath your pillow because they'll totally believe that that's you still lying in your bed. You know, because that's what I did, and that's what you did. Uh, oh no, you used the broomstick, and I used the salu, and it was no, totally, I the well, it was totally believable. Ah, uh, that's what you could do, and then jump out the window, but not if you live in an apartment building. Uh, yeah, that's about it, I think. I'm running out of ideas, but when I come up with some other ideas, I'm gonna email you personally, okay?